Hey, welcome back. Uh, so there is something I did forget to do before um, I go to the next area. It's not that important of a thing. This is a side mission, but I like doing it anyway because it's it's one of the indistinguishable collectibles in the game, which is all the songs. This is the only side song, you know, the one that you don't have to get. So I'm just going to run and get it really fast. And it's going to be some pose, but that's okay. Post, post be nothing, yo. I go here, go boom, ba ba ba. Oops, did it wrong. Meant to do this. How can I forget about Shay Shay? So I'm about to go inside a crypt. A very cool. This is this is one of those like cool little Zelda moments that it's hard to forget. Literally, I I used a song to summon a lightning bolt that blows up a thing. Come on, what what why why is this a thing? That's I. You know what would make more sense is if I if somehow playing this song teleports me inside of it or something. But whatever, I'm not gonna question it. Okay, I think I messed up. No wait, I think I did I mess up? Can I not physically do this until I have the ability to do stint fire? Are you kidding? Okay, never mind. Oh, how do I get out? Oh, maybe I just have to kill everyone. Oh, I'm stupid. You don't need dense fire. You just you need it for some, you need it for the treasure in this room, which I don't care about because it's probably rupees or whatever. I think that should do the trick though. Okay, good. Whew. The next part is. This is one of the. This is like the one of few horrific things in this game. They're called Reed Deads, and I just can kind of walk behind them because they. Oh, that one saw me. Whatever. Bye. One second. They're not really a threat. Let's go up here and check it. There's even a little. Uh, they even scribble it on the side here. It's a little poem. Ooh, it's a little secret melody. It's Yura. Y-R-A. Wow, that's a weird song. Y-R-A. Y-R-A. This lovely song is a song that would have helped me earlier. Well, I guess I really couldn't have done much to get here before. Um, Anyways, whatever. It's a, it lets you change day to night and night to day. It's a time manipulating song. And it's also a side one. You don't really need it. But what's great about it is it, par it paralyzes undead. So I can do this now. Bring it out. Go. Ba, 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 ba. There you go. Da, da, da. Now they're all ow. Now what's if you if I wanted to I can kill them for like twenty rupees each or something, but I already have max rupees. It's really hard to not be maxed out at this point. Also I think if you play the song gear you get something cool to happen, but I don't care. That's it. That's all I did. So simple. Oh, you also can. There's also the composer guy. It's fine for fun. Come on, buddy. Oh, it's taking too long. Ah, <sighs> way too long. Okay, so the next place I need to go to is Zora's Domain, which has the river. Yeah, I gotta climb up. It's not really a difficult thing to do, but 
I said nothing in this game is difficult. There are things that are more difficult than other things. Also, I could start the longest trading thing in the game, which is to get the bigger on sword, but eh, I don't care enough. Time to go up a river. My super fast rolling abilities. So much fun to roll around. Um, I hope this is not a dumb idea. Oh, I think there's a little edge here I can climb. Yep, perfect. It's kind of <laughs> gotta climb up uh, quite a bit of crap here. Oh great, my favorite bullshit. Oh, okay, thanks. Uh, it's kind of funny, but I think if you try to do this, right, you... Oh. Watch, you can see explosion in about a second. No? No explosions? Okay, never mind. I just wasted the bomb. So I, th I can't remember if you need to use, um, there's some things you're, I think you're supposed to use a c the chicken for something here. Cuckoos. Or you can just kind of, oh, right, to get that heart piece, which I don't care about, because I don't care about heart pieces for this. I think I could have had enough for a heart by now if I actually tried to collect them all, because I missed, I know I missed at least two, and I collected one. And I collected two, and I missed that one too. So... I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, it's pretty uh, straightforward. Just have to run up here. Avoid all the fun things I could possibly be doing, but I'm not. Eh. Climb up here. Jump across. Go up here. Play the ocarina. Another heart piece right behind me, which is... They, at this point, you can easily have gotten another heart. That's, they kind of set you up for that. But once again, I don't care enough. Now do like Moses and part the river. It would have been cool if they actually made like an energy barrier show up over the door. And think, oh. But whatever. That's cool too. Here we go, we're in the next area. Hooray! Um, so... There's a thing that, there's... I think it's optional, but I'm gonna do it... Oh no, you have to do it. So you have to get the silver scale, which allows you to dive deeper in the water, which is useful. And the only way to do that is to go over here, ignore the king. He's like... Rah, 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 rah. And just go over here, and... There we go. Diving school. Okay. Please be close, be close. Oh, I got three of them in a cluster, that's cool. No. Next ones I can probably get in a row, like this. Nope. It's okay. Once again, you have plenty of time. It takes about like Six seconds to get each one. Sweet. Done with this crap. I think this this part is kind of like a weird this is a weird upgrade to me, the one that we're about to get. You get something called silver scale, and yeah, it gives you the ability to dive more, but how does it work? I mean there's maybe this uh, I don't know. It's like a little bobble. You just kind of have it and it does things. Whatever. Give him a prize. Sparkly. 
Well, that's going to be the end of this episode. Uh, see you guys next time. Bye.